Today, we will be covering two tight regions, the determination of boric acid and borax mixture. First of all, the principle of borax mixture. If a pure sample of borax dissolves into water, it readily hydrolyzes into two things, sodium hydroxide and boric acid. And as we all know, boric acid is a very weak acid, so the produced NOH can be directly titrated with standard HCl using methyl orange. Our second determination of today, boric acid. We add glycerol to the previous neutralized solution and then we titrate with standard sodium hydroxide using phenolphthalein to determine the boric acid resulted from hydrolysis of borax and boric acid, which was originally present in the mixture. The addition of glycerol is to enhance the acidity of boric acid. The liberated protons can be directly titrated against standard sodium hydroxide using phenolphthalein. As for the procedure, on the same conical flask, we add neutral glycerol. We add a double the volume of 0.1 NHCl used. We add 10 drops of phenolphthalein, and we titrate with 0.1 sodium hydroxide till the end point. As for our set, so end point, it's the first pink color we see inside the yellow color that we already have present, and that's that.